The Crab Self-Propelled Howitzer, developed by BAE Systems Land Systems, won international competition to meet future self-propelled artillery systems requirement for the Polish Army. Polish requirement was for around 130 howitzers of this type. The first order was expected in 2008. However, Polish MOD halted its order due to a possible bribery case. A total of 24 howitzers were ordered. In 2011, the first prototype was ready for firing trials. By 2012, a total of eight howitzers have been built and were delivered to the Polish army. At the time future of this artillery system was uncertain due to various problems, including lack of suitable chassis for this artillery system. Indian Army expressed interest in obtaining these Polish artillery systems, however no orders were placed. Nevertheless, Poland managed to overcome problems and ramp up production. By 2021 a total of 96 crab howitzers were in Polish service. In 2022 it was announced that Poland is donating 18 of these howitzers to Ukraine in order to defend against the Russian invasion. Agreement was also reached to sell another 56 crabs to Ukraine. By November 2022 Poland delivered a total of 54 crabs to Ukraine. In 2022 Poland ordered another 48 crabs for the Polish army. These will be delivered in 2025 to 2027. Turret of the Crab is almost identical to that installed on the British AS-90 Braveheart. This turret is licensed produced in Poland. It is fitted with a 155mm L52 howitzer which is compatible with all standard NATO 155mm ammunition. The Crab has an automatic shell loading system and modular charge system. Maximum range of fire is 30km with standard HEFRAG shell and 40km with rocket-assisted shell. A total of 60 shells are carried. It is also compatible with precision-guided munitions. Secondary armament consists of a roof-mounted 12.7mm machine gun. The Crab is fitted with a Polish Topaz fire control system, intercom, and radios. This this artillery system has a Danish muzzle reference system, which tracks outgoing shells and adjusts the next shot. Hull and turret of this self-propelled howitzer has an all-welded steel construction. Armor provides protection against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. The crab is fitted with NBC protection and automatic fire suppression systems. Early production crab howitzers used a modified chassis of the Polish PT-9120 man battle tank. It was powered by AS-12U diesel engine developing 850 horsepower. These howitzers could reach a top speed of 60 kilometers per hour. These systems were fitted with a self-entrenching blade and could prepare defensive emplacements on their own. However, since 2012 production of the S-12U engine, that powered the PT-91 tank and crab howitzer, stopped. A German MTU-881 K500 engine was proposed as an alternative. However, it would not fit in the crab's hull without substantial modifications. In 2013 it was reported that the crab will use chassis of the Turkish T-155 Fertina self-propelled howitzer. However, in 2014 it was reported that Poland plans to acquire 120 track chassis of the South Korean K-9 self-propelled howitzer. Actually, the Turkish T-155 is a license-produced version version of the South Korean K-9. Most likely that it appeared more reasonable for Poland to import chassis directly from South Korea rather than from Turkey. First new hulls for the crab were completed in 2015. It was planned that 36 units will be produced in South Korea and the rest 84 in Poland. A battery of crab artillery system consists of six crab self-propelled howitzers, two ammunition resupply vehicles, based on the Star 1466 6x6 trucks, War and Maintenance Vehicle and Azalea Artillery Command and Control Vehicle. During the 2022 Russian invasion to Ukraine this artillery system recommended itself well. Ukrainian soldiers, who previously operated the Soviet 2S-19s to S-152mm self-propelled howitzers reported that the crab is much easier to operate, has significantly longer range and is more accurate than them stays combat use of the crab revealed that most shells land within 50 meters from the designated target.